Okay, welcome. This is a little episode that I'll be calling Root War Basics. Um, I'm going to go over the extreme basics of the game, so if you're um, a bit advanced, uh, you're probably not gonna be learning too much. Um, this is basically aimed at uh, beginners, because um, I've seen some of them recently, and um, yeah, I just wanna I'll just be talking about um, some build orders for Protoss, um, how you will uh, adapt the build orders um, depending on what you see from your opponent, and. Um, First, I'll be starting with uh, some splitting, like at the beginning of the game, what you're gonna do, and um, talk about some general ideas of the game. And um, yeah, I think let's get this party started. Uh, first thing to note is that it doesn't matter uh, where you put your cursor. Like if I put my, um, if I start a game and I put my cursor in the bottom left, it doesn't matter, it is always going to spawn or it's always going to be on my nexus. Bam! There you go. See? Nexus. So you can basically blindly go um, left click and build a probe P at the beginning of the game. And um, as the boot war AI is not that advanced, um, splitting is... Um, kind of required. Um, sometimes the AI does a split for you, but most of the time it just fucks up. And there are basically uh, two methods to splitting. First one is uh, using this screen, like using clicking on individual uh, probes. And the second one is using this tab down here and using shift click. Um, I'll demonstrate the standard, like the manual clicking one right now, because uh, that's, that's the one I use. I'll probably fuck up, because uh, it's not that easy. So you box, and then you go bam, 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 from the top. You just go from the top. It's the most easiest uh, thing to do. And um, so let's load up another game, and uh, let's look at the second... Uh, second possibility to split your units. Um, by the way, I'm only uh, C level, like max. My max level was C, so um, it's not the holy grail of information that I'll be providing. Okay, so it doesn't matter what I do with my mouse. Game starts, bam. You just go click, bam. Easy. So, do this, 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 and this. Like, I'm not used to doing that, because um, I use this, metho uh, this method sometimes, but I only use it uh, to split when I'm um, transferring probes to my um, to a natural. Because it's um, when you transfer probes, you'll probably you probably have like five of them like right now, and um, if you send them some somewhere, you, uh, they're gonna stack, and then you can't use uh, the manual splitting technique. So if I go there, as you see, they stack, and then it's easier to do uh, to click down here and use shift click. So let's load up another game. Okay. So we are to splitting now. Um, let's go to the next phase of the game, which is basically like the most uh, basic thing that comes next after splitting. Sh would be scouting, I guess, but um, I'll go into scouting um, more deeply when I'm talking about uh, build orders. So what you see people do is go like this, this is just uh, to keep them busy, like in the early game, spam APM, 
get your hands used to moving, like doing things all the time. There's like no real benefit from doing this and um, uh, Hot King, yeah, I wanted to talk about Hot King, that's pretty important. Um, as a Protoss, I suggest you use the English version of the game or the English hotkeys because uh, the hotkey for building a probe is P and um, it's pretty comfortable if you uh, put your Nexus on 8, you can go 8P and if you have uh, a natural, you can go um, 8P, 9P. You, you always do 8P, 9P, 8P, 9P. And if you get a third nexus, you put it on 0, and then you can go 8P, 9P, 0P. So that's pretty easy, pretty easy muscle memory. Um, what else do I do? You always want to hotkey your scouting probe, of course. Because uh, this will give you the ability to jump to it much faster. Like, bam, you're there. Um, gateways, I usually uh, hotkey them to 7 and 6. And maybe 5 if I go like uh, 3 gate all in. And um, then you got your units on 1 to 4 and late game you're probably gonna use 5. Um, it's also pretty important to um, divide your units like uh, put all zealots in one group and all dragoons or um, use a separate group for um, high templar that's also pretty important and probably the most important thing in brood war is using shift f2 f3 and f4 you can basically uh, save a screen position and just hit F2, which I'm going to do right now, bam, you're there. And um, the most important thing about this is that if I would have done like, um, if I would have hit 7 two times, I get the gateway. But if I select this probe, go F2, I still have the probe selected. So you basically what you, what uh, a lot of players do in um, PvP, because uh, that's a matchup that's pretty harassment heavy. Um, if they see uh, a drop, a drop happening in the main, they go like, select all probes, go to the, oh, that's the wrong one, okay, select all probes, go to the natural, bam, and you can evacuate pretty fast, compared to go there, click, and go there. Okay. Uh, what else would you be doing? Um, hot keying. What else is pretty important about hot keying? Um, I think I've uh, covered all the basics. Um, I think I had something else, but I forgot it. So um, let's talk about moving the unit. Um, probes actually have kind of a. They accelerate quite quickly but they have a short time where they are accelerating so it's pretty important to keep your um, probe moving at all times because then you'll be able to react much quicker because if the probe is standing still it just has to accelerate first before it's uh, on maximum speed I mean that's not that obvious but it uh, makes a difference sometimes um, yeah I think that's basically it uh, going over the most basic things uh, that you want to think about. I mean, you gotta, th you gotta find your own style. Um, just play around with hotkeys, maybe you like other things better. It's just how I do it. And um, I think I'm just gonna go into some uh, build orders next in the next few videos talk about those and if you have any questions that uh, go deeper into the game I'll gladly try and answer them just post them in the comments or write me a PM